Welcome back everyone, I hope you're doing well as always. Welcome back to another SCUM video. This one I'm in drone mode, uh, I'm in B3 bunker. I've been to a couple of bunkers and the layout seems to be pretty similar. So I'm gonna go into drone mode and show you how to reach Mr. Brenner's lair. And I'll go into the generator rooms, I'll go down the route you need to go and eventually show you where the armories are and uh, how to get down there. Right, let's go. Right, obviously if you've got no key card, you're gonna to need to pick this door. hack your way through there and you'll see there's quite a few doors that you will need to get around so make sure you loot all these containers on your way in and look for fuses and look for anything that help you this door would be closed I've already opened this one so this would be another one you'd have to hack if you was coming here during the day and uh, you didn't have a key card right now this is where you need to pay attention because always go left okay always go left here is your first generator room this door will be closed and if you don't have a key card then you'll have to hack this door as well so you can see where it's going so that's main door second door third door if you don't have a key card so check everything on the way down you might find a key card there then you have to go into the fuse box if you've got the correct fuses if you just want to get straight down to Brenner you need to get down to the stairs there the arrows so you will need at least um, 400 amp fuse to open up A B and C once you've done that and you've dealt with any razors that will be coming for you 100% so this will be another door that you have to deal with if you don't have the key card it's another one that you have to hack so already you've just got to here and that's four doors so you can see the trouble that this could get you in you will have some doors off to the side and they will feature these keypads here and you can see sort of the numbers grayed out so the guessing game to get into those right we keep going I'm not going to edit this out so you can actually see the path that I'm taking this would normally be shut as well so I've flown down here just to make sure I've got the route right so you can see so you saw on the board we sort of had to loop right around the uh, top floor basically and up here you got some depositories so you have to do the codes on them and you do have one small armory here as well as grabbing all the loot that you're um, looking for any hardware boxes any crates um, like I said these doors will be shut there you go you got some more hardware stuff in there some more loot so get yourself in there Right now, you don't want to go that way because that loops all the way back around to the generator room. Obviously, if you need to loot, then loot. You go through this door here. And then you get to the stairs, which will now take you down to level two. Right, when you get down here, there's only one way you can go, and that's that way. You have a huge room here where there is obviously doing some works on the mechs. Make sure you search the mechs. You can pick up um, the grenades, the circuit boards, same things you can when you destroy the mechs. Obviously, you ain't got the mechs to deal with. And uh, you should find quite a few toolboxes in there. The red toolboxes, they will seem to be spawning um, like a good one. Right, so we go back down this way. And what we need to do now is we need to find the second generator room. Now you might see a pattern come in here, turn left left seems to be the way to go and here you go you have the second generator room right and onto this one it shows where you are it shows where Brenner is up there you can see that and above Brenner in G is the three armory rooms so that's where the goodies are so here you can see ABC again will get you around left left and then right so same as the first level as you come in left left to the generator room then straight down and right and into the stairs and then down here so you will need to open a couple of doors there and then you'll head back out here and it's the same way you went when you was on the first level obviously you've got all these um, extra rooms over here that you can go and loot but if you're interested in just getting sort of straight down that's exactly what you want to do So another door to hack if you don't have the uh, key card. And 
another door. I do remember those fuses burn out, so once there's no power, you're almost knackered. Another small armory there, depository there, so you carry on down. And here we go. Now you are in to the main chamber. To the left was where I showed you them three rooms on the map, that's where the armories are. And there he is. There is Mr. Brenner himself. Alright, so we'll spin around from Mr. Brenner. And then we'll open this door. You will need to want to hope you have a key card. If you do manage to get in here, Mr. Brenner can open doors. So maybe you need someone to lead him away. But once you're in, Room one, room two, room three. You will need to uh, do the keypad, but as you can see, you've got plenty, plenty of stuff to loot down here. I don't know what it's going to be like on my kind of loot settings, but as you can see, this um, is quite substantial. So you've got three rooms that could be chock full of weapons but I definitely look forward to um, seeing someone uh, do that and get in there with um, out alerting Mr. Brenner I don't know whether there's a way to creep past him but do remember if you manage to shoot him a few times apparently from some of this blood or blood he drops you can collect his blood and make phoenix tears so you can buy yourself some syringes from the uh, doctor about 50, 50 scum bucks a pop where you can find them around in medical facilities and um, you can collect his blood and use that for Phoenix Tears. So there you go, that is how to get down into Mr. Brenner's lair. Remember when you come down, left generator room, down on the second level, left generator room, follow it round to the opposite side and here you shall get to. Alright, I hope that helped. Um, yeah, you're braver soul than I am if you get down here and uh, grab some of that loot. <laughs> Good luck. Right, take care, stay safe out there, and I'll see you in the next one. Ta-da for now.